What's up, everybody? Welcome back to the Game Channel. My name's AJ Gills. How y'all doing? I am finally sitting down to marathon the end of this game. I've been meaning to do it for the last two days and just keep procrastinating. Nope, gonna finish it. You've only known him a few cycles. Telenesan is a common language in some realities. The Jatauri don't always blow up Planet X. I am Groot. Yep. There's a dimension where I learned to speak it from a very aggressive compost vendor on Nowhere. <gasps> Groot loves compost. Because <laughs> I think Groot could become compost. Good thinking. Get the watering sorted out before we go. I am Groot. <laughs> I am Groot. <laughs> <laughs> he looks so sad, swishing around in his robes. <laughs> what? What? What would he say? <laughs> Gro Groot wants to water the Grand Unifier. Oh, right. <laughs> the soaked Unifier. <laughs> the, the Grand Humidity. I am Groot. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I love that Mantis is over there talking to the llama. Oh, ba -ba 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 -ba, what did I want to do? Right, I want to see what his last skill was. Groot revives all down guardians and their ability cooldowns are set. If the ability is available and Star Lord is incapacitated, Groot will automatically. Okay, so it's an auto revive. All right. Hey, Rocket, working on something? I'm always working on something. You're not listening to my tunes? Uh, yeah, I am. Uh, no you aren't. You don't even have headphones on. I got multiple brain chips, Quill. I don't need no headphones. Whoa. Music straight into your brain. That's amazing! What do you need to focus on so badly anyway? Something that might give us a way to get through the armada around Sacrosanct. Just in case Lady Skull Suit doesn't show up in time. Nice, what is it? You'll see. Yeah, yeah, I heard you. Oh, okay. I thought I had more, more parts, and I do hey, not. I hope you appreciate me more after all that. I don't know what it is, but this you really likes closing fridges. The door keeps opening, so I close it. But it's broken. I mean, it's always broken. It's a universal constant. Huh? More you know, Mantis. I've got so many questions. I know, and I've got so many answers. Like, seize the means of production. Or, it's not just a rash. Or, yes, it is gluten-free. <laughs> uh, not the answers I was looking for, but now I'm wondering about the questions. What questions? What happened on Lamentis after we left? He said some people would survive, but that doesn't fare super well for the others. Many of the elders died. They didn't resist the invasion, but they would never accept the promise. It isn't their way. I'm sorry. Don't be. Their sacrifice bought time for me and the Kotati to hide most of the others. They will emerge when the galaxy is saved. So you were able to hide them in the caves. Hope you told them to stay away from the fog. How did you convince Lady Hellbender to meet us on Maklu 4? You weren't even with us when we decided to go. Actually, convincing her to go after you wasn't hard at all. But convincing her to hear you out? Whew, that was tough. I had to get all creepy mystical and spook her with warnings about what would happen otherwise. You told her about the end of the universe, and she believed you? Oh, no, not at first. But when I brought up all her precious monsters dying, she came around. Couldn't take that chance with her babies, you know? Well, I'm glad to have you with us. Oh, good, because you're not always glad. Why not? Well, sometimes I'm your ex-wife. What? <laughs> I think she's pulling your leg, Quill. It only ever happens the one time, but it's so funny. God, I love her. <laughs> Aw, she says thank you for getting rid of Aiden Warsock. Apparently she likes me better. Uh, Adam Warlock? Yeah, him. She thinks I'm bleats. It translates weird. <laughs> Oh my god, I, I want to find the actress who played who played Mantis and just give her a big hug. Oh, how was it uh, riding along with Lady Hellbender? Did she have you try on battle armor? Oh, no. She's very respectful of other women's bodily autonomy. We just talked. 
She asked about you. She better not have said anything about me reaching my big size. No, no. You only turn into Big Fuzzy in one or two Fringe realities. What? She wanted to know if you'd give her your bomb recipe, though. She said you did a job on her throne room. Only if she pays for it. Man, this thing is ugly. Ah, let me... Thought we could use it if we ever need to hide our identity during a job or something. First of all, a Glarnot mask ain't no identity. Glarnot? They're that gang from the Planet of the Rain's Emeralds or something, right? Or am I confusing them? It's diamonds. Oh, yeah. And B, there's only two jobs I've ever needed a mask. The time me and Groot knocked over a top-secret lab. Really? Oh, yeah. The other time was when I borrowed a Glarnot mask and accidentally stole Groot from the Collector. When did you guys rob a secret lab? Eh, it was before we came after you. This Signog named Wheeler reached out to me and Groot. Wanted us to steal a bioweapon from some research lab in Arago 7. Piece of cake for a crack team like me and Groot. <laughs> wait, wait. And Groot wore a mask for this? <laughs> Man, you should have seen him, Quill. Bark naked except for the stupid mask of Thanos. It was fucking hilarious. <laughs> yeah, I bet. Why? It was until we realized the eggheads on Arago actually hired Wheeler to get us there. Uh, six out of ten times, it's a trap. Yep. Turns out they wanted to study us. My implants, Groot's regeneration, super valuable to the right bidder. By the time I realized what was up, they'd got Groot. Locked him in a freaking cage, Quill. Like an... like an animal. Ugh, that's terrible. Yep. Well, joke's on then. We weren't about to be turned into science experiments anytime soon. So, I went with plan B. One explosive charge later, and ba-boom, we were home free. <laughs> and the bioweapon? Sold it back to Wheeler for triple the price. Nice. <laughs> yep. <sighs> Those were the days. Why did Groot have to wear a mask for that? And also, why a Thanos mask? I get it's funny, but... How'd you accidentally steal Groot? You have to understand, Quill. I was on the run back then. The war was still raging strong, and then Kree scientists weren't exactly happy I left Halfworld. I had to keep a low profile. By robbing the Collector? I was broke! And no offense, but the way the Collector plasters his face all over nowhere like he owns the place... He doesn't own the place. Someone had to knock him off his stupid Flarkin pedestal! Ah, uh, the fact that I was drunk when I did it just makes it funnier. Is there a, a bounty out for you that I should know about? Relax. Anyways, I lifted one of them stupid Glarnot masks from some passed out jerk at Mantlos, stumbled my way to the Collector's Emporium, put on the mask, flashed some shiny rocks I found, and when his assistant's back was turned, I punked him on the head. <laughs> oh, you're unbelievable. I know. It was gravy after that. Once I was sure he was out, I started cleaning out the place. Woke up the next morning on a stolen transport with a bag of loot and Groot. Uh, of course, he was just a baby back then. Barely taller than a weed. Aww, baby Groot. I knew right then and there that I had to take care of him. A cage ain't no place for guys like us. We've been partners in crime ever since. That, I believe. Eh, believe what you want, Quill. Truth is truth. I'll just put this back. You know, those shots from behind, I, I never noticed that uh, Rocket had a chunk of his one of his ears missing. Not important, I just find just an interesting Quill, detail. Spar with me. <laughs> uh, I, I think I'll pass, Drax. I uh, don't want to get tired before the real fight. Bet those moves are really going to impress Lady Hellbender. I do not need to impress her. Besting the great Fin Fang Foom is proof enough of my combat skills. Yeah, that would do it. I'm not sure Lady Hellbender was really impressed with how we handled that fight. You know, since we accidentally killed that dragon before Groot revived him. Do not be impressed by a man slaying a dragon. Maybe if he does it without my help. <laughs> Raker's going down this time, Gamora. I promise you. And I promise you, I'm getting Nikki out of there. 
No matter what. We will get her out. Together. Together. Yeah, anime, friendship, power, etc., etc., etc. Well, I, I was thinking about something. What I want to say. No, no, not like that. I was, I, I, I was partially trying to talk about this in the last video. I'm not sure if I ever got the point across or whatever. Uh, but I, it, but I got into a little more detailed conversation in the comments of the last video with Brian Gade over um, something weird I've noticed. And that is that boss fights in this game are really kind of bland. Like, I, I'm not sure if you noticed, I barely said a word during the Fing Fang Boom fight. Just because there wasn't, really wasn't much going on. I really found that section to be pretty boring. And we're back! Deja vu. Is it just me or that fleet looks twice as big now? Wrong. It's at least thrice as big. That's the biggest I've ever seen it. What now? Kill the lights, kill the engines, and wait for Lady Hellbender to show up. <laughs> We're sure she's coming, right? She is a woman of honor, a queen. She promised to gather her forces. And how long is that going to take? Too long? No. We can't be too late. We gotta save the galaxy and Nikki. One way or another, we need to get in there and shut down that ritual. We can't take on a fleet that big. Little Fuzzy! Rocky, what are you doing, man? We need to get into Sacrosanct to disrupt the ritual, right? We all know we get killed out here. So, I'm gonna make a really loud distraction. My tunes! Yeah, I rigged it to blast your scuddy music across all channels. While the church is out looking for the source. We cut the engines and we flow silently right past them to board the sacrosanct. Smart. Seriously? Fine. But we're getting it back as soon as we win. Now get back in here. Oh. The pain. I didn't notice that little rockets on it. That's so adorable. All right, let's find a place to park. Wait a minute. I, I also want to throw a throw a small small timeout here. We could have just done that from the start, so that whole Fing Fang Boom fight was unnecessary. Just sorry, Quill. Chances are they're gonna blast it to pieces once they pin it down. Let's make sure this sacrifice counts. Can we not call it that? I mean, isn't that a sacrifice? Isn't, well, that was a gift from his mother. I mean, that's... It, it, you know what I mean. You can make fun of the music all you want, but I mean, like, the player and all that stuff, that was a gift from his mom, was it not? Oh, wait, no. We saw him get a cassette in the past, not the play. Whatever. I stand by my statement. They out there, but they can't hear us through the ship's hull. Yet you're still whispering. Because I don't want to be the one to flark it up if they can hear through it. But they can't. Well, certainly if they could hear us. Real quick, finishing that point that I was making earlier, it's just, I, I find the boss fights in this game to really kind of be bland and uninspired. Like, the actual combat itself, it took a while, but I, I've i actually really come to enjoy the combat. You know, I think it's just compli complex enough to be fun, um, but not too much to the point where it's obnoxious, and that was Fing Fang Foom. Yes! Lady Hellbender has arrived! Guardians of the galaxy, stop hiding! The monster lords of Seknoth 9 hunger for battle! We're not hiding. We are sneaking. Because we need to get into Sacrosanct alive. Then we will slaughter as many as we can out here while you fight your way in. Eat, my children! Crack open their shells and feast upon the sweet meats inside! 
<laughs> Gross. Well, yeah, whatever my point was. It, it's just generally, I find the combat itself fun. It's good. But the, the boss fights are weak in a weird way. All right, people, let's take advantage of a nice lady murdering spree. We're busting into Sacrosanct. That landing base are way in, but there's still a lot of pain between here and there. Maybe we can blow past them. Risky. Boom! Ah. No. Ah, that's right. I was trying to remember which button was the, uh, the boost. Any of those greens end in a fiery crack? Crap, that's a lot of turrets. Kill them or die. We gotta get through there. It's taking fire. Rude says it's maybe better not to get caught up. Well, that's nifty. Mantis, you sure you can fly her? Yes! Sometimes! <laughs> Is this one of those? Two arms! The enemy approaches! Ah, uh, yeah, we already read... Dib, dib, dib. Yeah. Already read about that. Get down here. Having fun praying on the week. Exactly why we're here. You heard them. Let's hit them until they pop and crunch. These deluded souls do not know when to quit. Can someone explain where these new costumes came from? Oh, see, I like how they took away our ability to do the huddle because we don't have his, uh, you know, his uh, his cassette player. These guys really need to work on their hospitality. In some cultures, this is considered hospitality. I got all these toys. I'm just dying for you. Okay, I feel that that was a really shitty joke that I just missed. Gardeners of the Galaxy. Everyone, put on! 
We must eliminate them and no conduit! Of course I think we'll win! We're the gardeners, ain't we? Ready! Prepare yourself, do. <sighs> See, kind of back on what I was saying earlier, how much I just, I've really kind of fallen in love with this combat. If, if you notice, I've gone completely, you know, during a lot of these big combat sections, I kind of go silent. Uh, I mean, it, it's not uncommon for me. You know, I have a habit of doing that when I'm really concentrating. Um, other times I do that, it's when I've really just kind of been engrossed in what I'm doing. I mean, not saying I'm not. This game doesn't take me, you know. Do, I, I don't have to concentrate in this game because I do, but like I said, it, it's it's oddly satisfying. How would you restrain one as powerful as the warlock? How can we be certain they have not found a way to convert the warlock? It would explain why they took him prisoner instead of just killing him. And there's a lot of faith Scott beaming into this place. If they found a way to turn him, we'll just have to go into his mind and fix him, too. I ain't jumping into that freak's promise. Can you imagine? Mirrors as far as the eye can see. Jars full of combs and cheap hair products. You use hair products. I, I feel like there'd be a bunch of thesauruses. The sore eye. I'm going with thesauruses. Hey! Mantis, no spinning! Why is she spinning? Don't worry about my flying. Just worry about your shooting. Oh. God damn it, I love you, Mantis. At least Mantis hasn't crashed the Milano. She's actually an accomplished pilot. The trick is to defeat them before they defeat you. These people fight without fear. They fully embrace the promise. And there's millions more where they came from. Let's hope Mantis and Lady Hellbender keep most of them busy outside. Doors flarked. Scut. We need to go that way. See if you can overload it. Are they still mad at us? Okay, okay. Sorry we left such a mess last time we were here. Oh, oh, oh. Let's see those branches! Imagine the havoc Lady Hellbender must be wreaking outside. Who's probably crushed half the armada by now? These strong worthies will have no way to quit! I kind of want to know how they made so many uniforms in such a short time! Maybe there's a giant closet on the ship somewhere! And it's dead. I still stand by my statement that I really wish that or that I really hope this game gets some sort of DLC centered around Mantis. Oh, F. So yeah, I mean, this whole cast is, is great. I love them. They really have great chemistry together. Oh, shit. You know, I, I said last video that I really kind of hope this cast does something else together, be it a sequel or just something else. You know, I just, like I said, I think they all have great chemistry. But God damn it, Mantis needs more in this character. Her voice is perfect. It, you know, just her voice itself is perfect. Mix that with her tone and everything. Just, oh my God, I love her. I kind of want to know how they made so many uniforms. Shut up, you already said that. Everything they got 
shot at us. And we will dodge it! Star Guy, what does the angry orange light on your controls mean? Which one? The one under the tape. Oh, now it's yellow. Now orange again. Ooh, yellow. Just ignore <laughs> it. <laughs> For my warning lights? You're distracting. You just lost your tape privileges. It's my tape. <laughs> See, whole thing. The whole thing of uh, the whole whole bit of that. Hilarious. All started by Mantis going. <laughs> all uh, all started by Mantis going. It's orange. Ooh, it's yellow now. Ooh, orange. Go, 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 go. You're thinking! This sucks! You mean it blows? Yeah, that too! I didn't think that would be safe, but eh, it was worth a shot. Star Lord's costumes make him look like he's a character from the boys. Shouldn't Rocket have some sort of mask on? I mean, because they are kind of in space. Okay. Go, go, go. Oh, well, I've asked these questions before. This game's never been 100% consistent on that. Okay, this reminds me of the end of the first Mass Effect game when you're on the outside of the Citadel. Anybody remember the section I'm talking about? Trigger finger has gone numb from all the murdering. I was 
thinking about something. Something while I was... Damn, I just, I had a thought before I got distracted by other stuff. Oh, right, it was about, uh... It, it, it was about that, that, uh, that boarding ship that Lady Hellbender sent in. You know, the one with the, uh... Uh, you know, the one that kind of enters, opens up to release all the... Uh, you know, opens up, releases all the uh, the troops on the inside. Yeah, I, I remember what I wanted to say about that. I, I was playing uh, the Star Wars RPG, which, you know, all cool stories uh, start with that. But <laughs> I, was, uh, I was playing the Star Wars tabletop RPG, and uh, I swear, that was the start of a can That was the, the start of our campaign. We got attacked by a ship like that. We should get back inside! I'm glad the space bomb stopped shooting at us. Save your nice words for later, Quill. The assassin has sabotaged the large one's equipment! What's next, Peter? Uh, beat the shit out of it? It'll be a slide! What are these lights obscuring my vision? Might want to check on that, Peter! Back in business! Oh, let us resume at full force! That's what you get, squat hoppers! <laughs> Rocket! Do you just make up those words or do they mean something? Rocket, can you pop the lock on that door? Yeah. Ah, oh. Well, that didn't work. The uh, panel's flarked. But I got a better idea. Hang on. He's gonna, uh... Yeah. I'm pretty sure if, uh, if you're gonna give call him by a nickname, Drax, I think he would prefer you keep calling him Rodent. I think the only one who gets to call him Little Fuzzy is, uh, is Mantis. There we go. Paths this way. Come on. All right. Let's keep moving. Valhalla. It was a noble death. Mantis, how's it going up there? So many dead. It's always one. <laughs> They're very brave. Hold on, okay? We're making good progress. You are very brave, too. <laughs> we have likely half of the galaxy's population. They are giving us much of a choice. Why was there just a random thing of ice there? Of course you wouldn't let him, you big lug, but what if she don't give us a choice? I'll take care of it. Even if it means... I'll take care of it. Thanks, bud. Any 
bets on what's down there? No. Better than being exposed up here. Guys, it's not too late to surrender. Awesome. Drop your glasses and we'll call it even, okay? I'm working on it. What the? Coach is choosing his team members. We must eliminate them in this little conduit. Put them up. I warned you. He's overcharging his pals. That's not good. Stop them. Stick it to him, Drew. Ah, need support. Oh, crap. This one's defenses are formidable. Oh. Let's try that again, shall we? Russia, let's resume at full force! What's next, Peter? Ugly sticks it up his crew! Well, that's not fair! Oh, He's boosting his squad! Let's pop that fool so he stops handing out tricks! I love that sound! Pulverize him! Thing blows up. All the more reason to kill him first. What the? He's just choosing his team members. Mega skies this day. It has nowhere left to run. You hear that? Monstery daddy's going down. I have a swing to the threat. Return to the skirmish. Appreciate the help, big guy. Prepare for pain. You have caused us consternation, but no longer. Keep the herd coming. So he gets to just go around healing his pals. Putting him away first will make things much easier. Um, how many times have I saved your butt now? There we go. This time, little buddy. That's a wrap. Look. They surrendered. We made a compelling argument, and we beat them mercilessly. Half expecting <laughs> a monster to come crashing through the wall. That would be very, very bad. Maybe we should keep moving? I would like to leave this enclosure. I cannot see the battle. You mean you might miss a peek at Lady Hellbender? And Fin Fang Foom. Do you think Foom holds a grudge? We bested him in his own lair. He will forever recognize us as his superiors. Yeah, well, he's Lady Hellbender's pet now, and she does hold a grudge. That is true. Okay, so not that way. These things are built like freaking Terminators! No, we will be there, Terminators. Yeah. You know what? He was, he was, uh, I'm not going to say close enough for the reference, but, eh, you know what? That's a, that's a pretty good quip by Drax standards, so. Things built tough. We need to really pile it on. Ha 
Latvian berserkers once set themselves on fire to intimidate their enemies. That is so messed up, but so awesome. Things pretty tough for an old machine. Ugh, they suck even when they're on fire. Yeah, well I like watching them burn. Oh shit. I've got to give you credit, Peter. Really? Your crazy plan is actually working. I never expected Lady Hellbender to show up here. I wasn't sure we were ever gonna find Fool. Ah, we did that, not just me. You're the one who brought us all together. And kept us together. Against our better judgment? That's because enemies ahead, Peter Quill. Rocky, tell me we're almost through this. Uh, we're harder than we were the last time you asked. You know, it was what I was saying about the uh, about the boss fights and whatnot. You know, in a weird way, these little like mini bosses or elite enemies or whatever the hell you want to call them, I actually think have more attack diversity and are actually a bigger bitch to deal with. Child, at once! Vegas has her in its control. We gotta kill it first. I'm, I'm still standing by my theory that she's not actually his kid. That the whole thing—it's been a—it it was just a red herring. If you know I'm wrong, please don't say anything. You know, it, don't spoil it before the end of the game. It's one of those things that if I find out that I'm totally wrong and that. You know, that they're not hiding anything from us. It's one of those things. I wouldn't really be surprised, I don't think. But it's one of those, if you make me pick one or the other, you know, uh, is it a red herring or are they, or is, or are they actually father and daughter? I go red herring. One just punched the shit out of it. Let's get tactical. Is this a dead end? Hard to say with all the Coming. <laughs> I believe this is your Star Lord. How'd she throw that? Are we not in space? Alright, that's awesome. Well, I mean, I guess she put forward momentum to it, so yeah, I guess it would work. Just so... Metal? Yeah. Yeah, I mean, what's more metal than a space battle and a dragon? Glad you got your music back, Will. You were the one who chucked it into space. Hey, it worked, didn't it? No harm done. Psychological harm was done. Take it down, Gamora. I Gamora. got this. Back into a hole. Great! 
Like holes. Ah, giant robot. I hate these things. I was gonna yell frame rate, but okay. Call you that because it's on the back of your jacket. It wouldn't be the weirdest thing we've seen. They're creepy either way. Come on, we gotta go topside again to reach Warlock. We survived this. We should invite Lady Hellbender to join the team. Uh, there ain't no room for her on the ship. She's like three quills high. One and a half quills at best. Her armor alone must weigh six quills. You know what? Let's vote on it. Do we invite Lady Leotard? Nope. Yes. He probably still wants to murder me, so... <laughs> Damn it, I should have waited a little bit. I'd love to hear the rest of the answers. <laughs> now that was unexpected. Fortune favors us. We were not sucked into the lethal void. Unless Raker shuts off the gravity. Just have to hope he's too busy with the ritual to think of it. Are we sure Warlock's all the way over on the other side? Yeah, as long as we keep moving forward, we're going the right way. We have found purpose. We will not die here. If we do, we will see you on the top. Correction. I will see you on the top. The rest of you will see whatever heathen paradise is you need. <laughs> whatever you heathen to? paradise. I'm following my gut on something. Perhaps Lady Hellbender will join us in our final battle against the Magus. Something tells me she's got her hands full. They are large hands. Strong hands. Yeah, I get it. Now where the flark is he going? It's called scouting, okay? It's a shame Lady Hellbender didn't have this kind of army to back us during the Galactic War. Building her legacy. We are fortunate to have her now. Yeah, let's stay on her good side. This is it. We're almost there. second there I thought that was a graphical glitch not like line after line of units popping down I, I thought the game was sputtering or something Cosmo is that you in there? Da Spasiba Guardian of Galaxies for helping Cosmo shake away promise he is no longer chasing stick that is snake. And look, 
Cosmo is bringing nowhere. Yeah, we noticed. And family. Say privet, my pops. Oh, it's good to have you back, buddy. Ha! Huh. Cosmo is very much like filthy fleas. You are thinking he is gone until he is biting on your ass. <laughs> He's such a good boy. Ned, Cosmo is best of boys. Yeah. I agree with that. These brain fleas the bites they deserve. Attack! So would we have had like a nowhere can fire death beams? This is sweet! And that dog has his paw on the nuke button. I'm gonna have to be nicer to him. So if um we didn't free him from the promise, would we have had a big fight there or we should keep moving? We are moving. I don't know. Well we should be doing it faster. Once we get inside that rock, chances are we're gonna have to go toe-to-toe -to -toe with the Grand Unifier again. We'll stomp on his toes. Yeah, well, he spanked us the last time we took him on. Wait, what's that? Ah! No, no! Let's be honest, the last couple times we've taken him on, we haven't really given him... Uh, what was I saying though? Uh, Root! Give him a minute, he just flew through space! <laughs> uh, I, I just I, I think we we're kinda of underestimating the unifier the last couple times we fought him. All of them! I don't like this! Ah, exhilarating! Of course you think it's fun! Watch out for debris! It is a good thing my skin is so resistant! Hope I don't tear my pants! Only suckers wear pants! This better lead somewhere solid! Don't blow up the edge! Don't blow up the edge! Acknowledge my velocity! Did, did he just scream, acknowledge my velocity? Yes, it did! Whoa! The tracker signal is way stronger in here! We're getting close! We're here for Adam Warlock! Bring him to us and we'll let you go! Hey, listen! <laughs> Do not hold back! Their god hears us! They have something to prove! What a waste! Minds like this were the backbone of the war resistance! I bet most of these freaks used to be miners! Oh, fuck me. I am fucking terrible at quick time events. Did you really down here somewhere? Kyle, are you present? She does not seem to be here, Peter Quill. How would we even know if the fulfillment has a gun? Lady Sir Magus is gonna devour our soul. It won't work. Just put him down. Keep them busy, crew! Magus wants to consume your souls! Yes, it ain't gonna be that easy, Max! This is looking less and less like a warlock prison! Trust in the Warlock's butt tracker! <laughs> Let's keep pushing. The signal's pinging from deeper in the mines. God, as we're running through here, though, just my brain keeps screaming JRPG. I don't know why, just like I'm looking around here feeling like it's a Final I Fantasy sure like, like dungeon or some shit. Wish they'd suck to digging. Laura, cut him down! You don't stand a chance! Hard to believe these tunnels used to be filled with miners instead of freaks! Idiots could have been wrecked if they stuck with it instead of following some stupid power! Like my very own taser! Wake up! You 
for being deceived! Somebody's still digging down here! I'm betting they use these precious metals for the faith tech. The Grand Unifier's golden to damage don't come cheap. Man, that giant robot can take a lot of pain! Thanks, Bill! Keep the breathing room, We need to really pile it on! Help him! You can drop us in here! Kill two star and act one arrow! This he knows how game hard game. we are to kill! He wouldn't risk it! If we had a way to take some of this ore with us! Ain't nobody trading that stud once the dirt is gone! Go risky! Chop him up! Get a group! Gladly! Your maker! Ooh, I just want to consume your soul! Oh, for the love of God, die! I'll enjoy this! If we don't stop Magus this time, it's all over! We ain't gonna fuck it up! Magus is as good as that! We got all these toys up this time! He's off his game! Let's knock him down! Let us feel the final blow! Loss of acquirement in open space. If you're attacked unprovoked, you have the right to claim the battle spoil. We have definitely provoked them. They provoked us Lots of times! Send it their way, Drax! Feels like I've been shooting that big butt for hours! It is as venerable as it is large! We must break it! Grab it close, bro! I shall enjoy this! Oh, wow! Remind me not to piss off Groot! Yeah, you're gonna have to hit him a lot harder if you want to wake him up! Like, as hard as you can! I am trying to destroy! Great idea, bud. If we pull this off, we should come back here and fill up our cargo hold. Sell the ore on the black market? Payment for a job well done? Well, we ain't making that jump. Peter's got this. He does? Peter Quill possesses the magical weapons. Hey, check it out. We got bad guys. Your safety inspector. <laughs> Drax, you gotta do it fast, like so. Safety inspection! Blam! You fail! Blam! You have failed your safety inspection. You know what to do, Quill. You know, that would be really cool if my frame rate didn't just go to shit after it happens. This old workbench is kind of crusty. All right, Rocket, let's prep for the big game. Let's do it smart. This may be the last chance we get. Uh, translation, this is the last chance we get, and we don't have Why enough do parts. Why me with crafting, Quill? Okay, I think I'm ready to end this. You and me both. What the? Hey, look, they get the Adam Warlock channel all the way out here. Speaking of Goldilocks, he should be right on the other side of that giant murder bot army. You've got to be kidding. They've got it locked down with a faith shield. Think we can unplug it like we did on Nowhere? It's worth a shot. Let's push through this, people. We want to keep the Golden God waiting. Keep the breathing room, Groot! Okay, what the fuck? There we go, it smooths out. Where's Warlock? Shouldn't he be Like, I'm not gonna... I'm, I'm not gonna sit and say, Oh my gosh, the... The frame rate in this game has been impeccable the entire game. It's... It's... It's been pretty stable. You know, there's moments that it would chug, but... Things will pop! We 
<clears throat> this section's really bad. Figure out where the. No longer does not waste time game. fighting machines! These deluded souls do not know when to quit! Unnatural strength rages in that one! Put him down hard! There we go. But where are these things that I'm supposed to. Whatever. If you haven't been able to tell from my bitching that the uh, that if you if you're checking your internet connection or whatever from all the uh, from all the sputtering, no, that that's just this section is. Better now, thanks. Nope, this section is just really choppy. Been too long since I blew something up. What is next, Peter Quill? We gotta get through that main field. We're wasting time. And uh, I can also promise you, I'm not missing an update or something on my on my Xbox. I'm not missing, you know, anything like that. It's just. Really choppy. Rip him a new one! Or in this the warrior does not go back to the park in the trees! Don't get hit by the enhanced one! Boost me next! This one just eats ammo! Can we prove persistence? Last time someone got stabbed! I've done you two! A tactfully executed maneuver! That base field! You're wasting time! This one hurts! Much! They will! Wanna see some fireworks? Woo! Show them your roots! With pleasure! Shit, just die. Guys, huddle up! <coughs> Excuse me. And now Peter's arm is glitching. And there's a glitch there with... He's right. We're getting our butts kicked. They appear to be superior. We can't take this any longer, Peter. 
Guys, come on! These goos aren't gonna take us out. We're better than them. Flarkin' right. So let's go out there and show these Flarkers who we really are. Who's with me? Today, I let's am the destroyer. Let's do this! Let's... These guys didn't get party invites! I ain't complaining! Oh, All them best bots can sit this one out! Get ready! Ah! The mechanical beast is running out of limbs! Great! Giant Psycho Robot Factory! And another giant robot. Fuck off. Fuck him off, Rocket! Put him down, you brute! Slow him down! Ha! Send all of your infernal machines! You cannot intimidate us! This should just be like the Cortex, right? How to call them one. Yeah, just gotta get access to you first. My great strength goes underutilized! They have seized the rodents! Do not let them convert him! We've got to be close to him now, right? The warlock will guide us if we find him! Nope, shit. No getting up there with all that fucking and tape you in the way! Let's unclog them one by one! Okay, you want to give me a... I, I mean, I get I'm supposed to pull out the cables, but... Oh, fuck you, Peter. I am trying to destroy! I see now. I'm just completely blind. God, can we get out of this area? Let the game stop loading so much shit. Figure it out fast, Quill. Oh man, that choppiness was really hurting my eyes. There, the warlock. Hang on, I'm calling us a ride down to Gold Cheeks. Make sure you grab on good. The drone, not the cheeks. <laughs> And unifier. Scott, everyone down. Finally come to confront the captive, castigate him for how far he's fallen. Shut your mouth for once. A clear shot. Don't. We can't risk a fight from up here. You show up on the very eve of our ascension. To what? Take everything from us once again? Me? Tell me what I ever took. My faith, and not just mine. You abandoned your flock. The very church you helped me build. You let us believe our god was dead, and with you, any hope of restoring those we lost. I thought that- You promised me, my son! I promised only partnership. You sought subjugation. My mistakes were many, but your mania is not among them. Enough! Enough of this! The true divine vessel awaits. You're nothing but a husk, a faded shadow. But even you will feel the light. Hear me. Halt this horror. Raker! Guardians, breach my bindings. Even now, Raker readies his restoration ritual. Rocket, can you bust him out? If I gotta... Let me guess. Raker's power proved more pernicious than predicted? There is little point in pondering <laughs> possibilities past, daughter of Thanos. Soon feverous faith will flood Raker's fledgling and feed the fiend within. Not gonna happen. 
We're gonna shut it down together. Right? Right. Okay, let's go, people. Come! Time dwindles as we dawdle. <laughs> I could put him back up there. Don't tempt me. If Magus finds physical form, its insatiable cravings will consume all of creation. Unless you eat Magus first. A severe simplification. We must excise the entity gripping the girl. But how much of Nikki will remain? If her light lives, it lingers lost, dissolving in a dream discarded. A pleasant dream. Drax completely bought into the promise, and we got him out. I would have required him. Well, end of the world here, remember? Hurry, go! Rejoice! You made it just in time for the miracle. Grand Unifier, I trust you can hold them to bear witness. Easily. Go. We couldn't cover up that pretty face for too long. Almost there. Focus on me, Peter. Focus on my voice. 